also need to find a coconut. A good prepper always hides different things in different places and always remembers the exact location. Let me show you something. This with army knife have many tools. This one is you make hair curly. With the point is thinning, you can carefully push into the three holes of the coconuts and drain water. You lick around the coconut. Carefully tap along the wet and the coconut will pop open effortlessly. Always recycle, never leave a trace, be nice to nature and wildlife. Getting out all the flesh is very important. Maybe let it dry for a bit. You can eat the flesh. Be careful at night. It attracts foxes and they can be quite mean and shit in your sleeping bag or foxhole until you have to leave. Let me show you something. Let me show you something. natural forest chitter can be very comfortable. Just make sure that no squirrels are inside. Always recycle, never leave a trace, be nice to nature and wildlife. Let me show you something. I 
I'm going to show you how to survive and defend yourself in the forest against the people looking for you because you maybe have made a little mistake in your past. Make sure you blend in with your environment. If Harry Pig wants to rub its genitals against you, that's good. It means that you became invisible. Hygiene is a very important routine to maintain. Let me show you something. the old dry tint of fungus they usually grow on dead trees we can carefully remove them this one looks like a nose <laughs> sometimes they are hard to get you can even sit on them Now, now that we have all the ingredients for our self-made coconut smoke grenade, let's get to work! In between the layer of tubes and the outer shell is the amadou, the tinder we want as smoking fuel. If you want to confuse your opponent, you can add other mushrooms. Now I can sneak up to my enemies and poop in the shoes whilst they're sleeping. If you do this frequently, you can take over their treehouse. <laughs> 